Welcome to KSP. This is the 1.1 per release version 1196. And we're going to play a career. Because why not? Thanks, I got it, Jane. We can do this one gather scientific data from the launch pad. Launch a vessel. That's all we can do. Let's make ourselves something stubby. Burner. Get going. Everyone's favorite starter little spacecraft. I'll put those here. That should do it. We're going to dial that back a bunch. We don't need a whole bunch of uh, rocket. Okay. Zero. I always call this one zero because it really doesn't go much of anywhere. Right. Grab some goo readings here. We'll have them grab that. Get the data. Let them do an AV airport. <laughs> That's a lot of science just for that. Let's get a crew report on the pad. Oh yeah, I need to grab that. I need to take the data. So now I can grab another crew report while flying. Okay, low atmosphere. Grab that. Crew report. We'll grab another crew report while flying. There we have it. Let's see if I can set this thing right down on a launch pad. We're gonna get kind of high up, aren't we? Not that I can tell. All right. So we got some world firsts here. Just free bonus money at this point. And I think we got our contract for launching a vessel. Yes, we did. This is a completely stock playthrough. I don't have any mods on it. I'm going to avoid mods until the actual build comes out. Looks like we'll land pretty close to KSC. Land near the, um, I think we're going to land at. Kind of hard to tell with the camera shake. Either right on the VAB or just next to it. Yeah, we'll, ne we'll be next to it. Okay. That wraps up that mission, pretty much. Ah! Like how the base plane hangar is literally held up by tape. See if this thing survives the landing. Yep, it does. Okay. Data. Okay. I can't flip this thing over, unfortunately. I can spin it, but I can't flip it over. All right, so let's say I remove that data and then get a crew report. AB. All right, free science. 35 science. Bad. I got an experience point. Let's spend some of this. The 15 and 18. I can only get any one of these. I don't want to get more than one though. Bigger tank and I get the Reliant. Fins, I don't know, not sure. 
in flight above Kerman. That's not too bad. I should be able to do that one very easy. Points of science and lots of money. And a... Ooh, swivel engine. Okay, here's what we're gonna do with that one. I don't need those guys anymore. Supposed to do the RT-10? I guess I am. Okay, so... We'll do this. What I'll do is I'll put a decoupler here. This thing's gonna fling my RT-10 into the high trajectory I need to have it. And then we'll have ourselves our level engine. Oh, that's not gonna work. fix the staging order, it's all messed up. Okay. All to fulfill a testing contract. Okay, let's run the test. Yep. Let's actually put that here. Oh, I still have that engine nerfed. Yeah, let's fix that. Forgot I had that turned down. Okay, let's just make that one stage. Okay, so we'll launch that again. My bad. Like, how come it's so slow? Run the test, thanks. Ah, uh, did I destroy that? Oh, probably just a decoupler that went bye bye because the engine's down there. Good. Do it. I think I did it. Yes. I did it. Right. Now we're gonna get going really, really fast. Here we are. Uh oh. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's do that again. Turn your way down. And let's even limit your fuel supply. That'll work. That'll work. <laughs> okay. Let's clear that contract out of the way. Can I get that contract? Yep. We still accelerate really, really fast. Fortunately, we're not gonna be hugely, uh, <laughs> we're not gonna burn up an atmosphere like we did before. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of you. Gonna need atmosphere? No, not quite. Whoa, that looked funny. Can I do that again? No? Okay, fine. Bummers. Fun with the F key while in time warp. The altitude records? Yeah, yeah, I think I got an altitude record. Land distance record, altitude records. I like how they're automatic. And they don't totally clutter up your feed. There we go. 
You must be the booster. Yep. You're the engine. Okay. I'm kind of a scrub today. I'm sick again. Sorry of my life. Much too fast for the parachute, so we're gonna wait. But we dial that back. There we go. Now capsules kind of scare me now because they don't slow down nearly as much as I'm used to. I'm gonna catch up to that booster. I'll wait a bit. So reader altimeter says, I think it 1500 meters will hit it. And now, if that keeps me from dying. Oh, oh. <laughs> that worked pretty well. I'm still about 100 meters off the deck when it finally opens, but that's not too bad. Oh, I should have got a upper atmosphere science reading. Well, I can get a crew report here. Oh, there's that booster. I just heard it went kapoof. Big data. Oh. Airport. Sure. Get on there. Lower the experiment. Now we're flying over the grasslands, despite not flying. Perfect! Cover. And once I get. No experience gain. Alright. That. There's no debris from over there. Okay. Next contract. Oh, I said Fortitude Science. Alright, perfect. Can I. I can get any two. So let's pick up this. And I'm debating. That would help out a lot. Yeah, because I'm going to want to make Orbit next. Well, let's see what else we got for contracts. Splashdown, splashdown. Surveys are kind of a pain in the early part of the game. Haul a Mark 16 parachute. Well, you kind of have to. Hmm, if I had a probe, I could try that. Oh, that pays nice. Orbit curbing. But yeah, if all those we're gonna leave atmosphere, we're gonna try to go for an orbit. So this will be the last mission of the session. And then we'll try some moon stuff when we get back. Oh. Oh, I don't have, um, cruises. All right, not a problem. I got boosters. Got those. Okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. Well, first, <laughs> I need to pick up this piece of tech which I just got. Good. I guess we'll throw on a slightly heavier LVT 45. Alright, here's where I'm going to get shady. I want... I want to put some boosters on this thing. Yeah, that doesn't look wrong at all, does it? Actually, it kind of does. <laughs> Alright, so let's do fine control on. Let's make sure these aren't smashing into each other. Okay, good. I think I can probably dial these back some. I don't need all that much thrust. I just want to have nice long burn with it. Okay. This should be enough. What? Oh, you're kidding, right? Ah, uh, fine. Oh, I'm not gonna get much use out of those things, am I? What if I use just two? Uh, 
I get away with just two boosters. I wonder if I need just one. I'll try that. And... I'll try some of that. Make sure everything flies good. I should do it. Gerbil Engineer would be great, so hey, let's bring that up some so I can see. Mass numbers. Oh, geez, really? I'm right on the cusp of borderline. Fine. Hope this works. Good. Should work okay. Clean over just a little bit. Is it just a little bit? And not much of a lean to it. Yeah, this ain't gonna be enough. I should probably just use one single booster and give that bad boy a bunch of fuel. And more acceleration off the bat, too. Nowhere nearly enough. ain't gonna be enough. But we tell us it's not gonna be enough. The trajectory looks kind of sloppy too. Yeah, my orbital velocity is going to be very low. It's only 800 meters per second now. Hmm, fun. I've used about half my fuel supply. Yeah, there's no way it's going to work. Too vertical. How much time we got? Not much time at all. Yeah, this is not gonna work. Not gonna work. Not at all. I need an LV-909. So basically this mission is... free. Yeah, we got the escape atmosphere contract, that's a good thing. And we're gonna splash down way in the water. Get rid of you. Add some goo canisters. We'll just accept it, I'm not gonna revert. Lessons learned. I get some re-entry effects. I'm probably not going nearly fast enough to even worry about it, but oh well. Oh, a little bit. See, any usage on my blader? Very little. Okay. And then we get to 1500 meters. Toggle that guy. And we'll smash into the water. Pick up a new record. 
a land distance record. Oh, you actually do get science for those. And a better reputation. That's good to know. I didn't know you got reputation for those, but it makes sense that you would. Eh. Time warping while landing in water is not cool. Eh. No, it probably wasn't. Oh, I got that one already. Okay. Experiments. Report from... Oops, oops, oops. I think grab that one. Alright. Recover. You don't get another experience point, you only get one for orbiting. Not just making space. Right? Nope, no XP gain. So well, here's my total reputation. So fifty nine. So I'm guessing I have so much trouble trying to read that stupid gauge. I wish you could make this part bigger, really, but, uh... Oh, 37. Well, I can get that for sure. That'd probably help out some. Alright. Can I... Upgrade you, yes. Can I upgrade you. And be broke, yes. Uh... Astronaut complex. EVA. I think that'll do it for now. Alright, this design sucked. Yes, it did. This part's not the problem, it's getting it up there is the problem. Right. One back booster. Let's see. Put some more boosters on here, like this. My ton of jet. Oh, well, my pad can handle a lot more, so that's a good thing. <laughs> well, now I can do the thing I wanted to do. Centered, yep. Okay, and I'll put some nose cones on here like so. And this should be more than enough. And we'll actually remember to bring two canisters. Place them on the orbiter. And we will hide them in here just a little bit. Actually, you know what? No, no. We'll, we'll, we'll put them here. And then we'll hide them in the capsule. There. Yeah. I wonder if that reduces drag. I should really do some... 2B. Yeah. Yeah, that'll help now. Now I'm not running into that 30 ton limit. That'll help quite a bit. Leave atmosphere no problems at all now. The problem is capsule torque is totally not enough to steer this thing at all. <laughs> and I'm gonna hit atmospheric effects or even ditch these stages. Oh, perfect. Well, that means I could probably just say forget. Oh, capsule. Come on, you can turn. I'm just gonna get this really steep arc, aren't I? Ah. Uh, that's funny. Okay. I suck. I can't play this game. Hey, maybe I could try retrograde. Hey, let's be different today. Oh, here comes the rancher effects.
Yeah, let's do retrograde because why not, you know? Just get rid of you. <laughs> not quite retrograde. Hey, that's a nice high altitude. All right, let's get ourselves a space canister. Space sample. Yes, we'll keep the experiment. EVA. Grab that, yes. Got an EVA report while way up here. Ward. A group, oh, I got one of those already. Okay, perfect, all right, all right, all right. They're fine. Bit early on that. This will either work or it won't. I'm not sure which one it'll be. I did pick up quite a bit of velocity. Quite a bit. Yeah, I ran out of fuel. Well, I am going to revert that one. Okay. What are we doing wrong? I think I can get away with more fuel. Yeah. And I think I don't need these fins. Uh, I think I can carry a bit more fuel. That'll be good, yes? Okay. Let's try that. Let's actually try the gravity turn really quick before airspeed gets in the way. Like that. Now, airspeed over this thing should keep it more or less where it needs to be. I should be able to just turn that off. And not worry about it. I should have just done this and forget the rest of the fixes I did. Oh, this is looking much better. Oops. That boost just like, peace out. <laughs> Hi. Hey, hey. Hey, you. I don't want you flipping out. I mean, you're kind of going the right direction. That's cool, but I don't want you. This is what I wanted the first flight. And gimbaled engines are just awesome right now. Gimbaled SRBs. There's some parts packs that do that. I think A's does gimbaled SRBs. I know KW Rocketry does gimbaled SRBs. And they are so sweet. Hey, that's looking real nice. Well, let's get an upper atmosphere reading now that I remember to do it. Yep. Get a crew report from upper atmosphere. Yep. Uh, it's a bit high to do the EVA trick, but we'll wait just a little. I think 60,000 meters is safe. Eh, maybe 65,000. Eh, good enough. Okay, so EVA report, yes. Capture that. Data. We'll take the data, we'll get on board. Right, so now that we're a bit, I can get a crew report. Oh, that's right, I got that already. Forgetting. Alright, get that. 
is. Now we can EVA and get some delicious EVA reports. Well, in orbit. Well, not orbit, but you know. Out of atmosphere. Get those biome reports. Okay. Is this a... Oh, it is a gimbaled engine. Okay, great. I need those for my stinking... I need those for my lifter. Oh yeah, we're looking real good now. This is how I'm used to doing things. I'll need about 2240 meters per second or so in order to call this an orbit. Let's get that uh, and how's that? Yep. 2240 roughly. Good. We just got paid. Sweet. For now, we have enough funds that I can think about upgrading to VAB, and I'll get lots of science from biome reports. Now, if I run a really spam biome, biome reports, I will throw something into a polar orbit. Grasslands, get aboard. But I can get a number of biomes just off of this. I can see the stupid planet. I think there's some mountains over here and some deserts that I can get. I'll alleviate that. It's really, really dark. Don't mind. <laughs> Not what I'm looking for. I just wait for us to see what we're doing. Okay, that looks like desert terrain down there. Airport. Highlands. Yes, that's a good report. Crater has some mountains here. There's deserts. If I can get one right on the interface between the oceans and the shore, I can get a shore report, I believe. Oh, so we'll come out of time warp and get out of map mode. Okay. Okay, get a shore report. No. No. I wonder if it is an actual biome. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Store the experiment. Islands. I got that one already. Mountains should be right about here. Yes. Okay, so we'll get back inside. So that's 24 points of science I don't have to worry about. Okay, so now I get some desert biome science. Yes. Word. Oh, wait, did I get that? Uh, need to make sure I get my goo canisters. Yes, I want to actually get all that crap. I do not want to lose out. All right, Jeb, let's go home. It's a good chance to do our burn to get us back home. Entered orbit. Hey, spacewalk. I got spacewalk twice. That's pretty cool. Got double paid for that one. Okay, are we ready for this? Well, he's gonna hit level one for sure on this guy. That looks pretty close to KSC, but we can get a little better. I need to go south just a bit. So let's go south just a bit.
Okay, here we are. We're gonna hit atmosphere. We'll be facing more or less that way, so. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> Doesn't like it when you do that. Let's not worry about. There we go. Ah, oh, let's see. I'm gonna miss KSC. I'm gonna I'm gonna land short. I don't know how short. I'm guessing really short. Okay, we're losing a blader at less than one per second. Hey, there's a booster. Bye, booster. Hi. Ooh, that was cool. That guy just stopped. Uh oh. <laughs> That's a problem. Yeah, that might be an issue because. Yeah, that's not cool. I'll do this now because I need the chute to open like right away. Because I need to slow way the hell down. And hopefully I don't slide down the mountain because that would suck. I hate mountain landings. I gotta ask myself just one question do I feel lucky? Let's turn you on because that might help keep us alive. Please don't kill my crew. Please don't. Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Really, really? Oh, this sucks. <laughs> Why? Oh my gosh! I'm so gonna die. I'm glad I grabbed that science. Oh my gosh. Oh. That really sucks. Mountains, why? Why you do that to me, mountains? Dang it. I'm gonna revert that. We'll do that again later. That was frustrating. Anyway, thanks for watching.